In this video, I will show you how to record voice messages in the voice modules of Eternity GE using the audio output of a laptop and a single line telephone. Eternity has a total of 16 built-in voice modules. In each module, you can record voice message of 16 seconds duration. Voice module number 01 is reserved for music on hold application. In the remaining voice modules 02 to 16, you can record different voice messages as per your required application. As an example, let us record a voice message into voice module 02 of Eternity G. There are five main steps. First, change the position of jumper J5 in the CPU card of the system. Next, connect the audio output of the laptop to the analog input port of the system. Next, select the recording source. Then, record the voice message. And finally, verify the recorded message. Let's start with the first step by changing the position of jumper J5 in the CPU card. For that, first, switch off the system. Now, unscrew the CPU card and gently pull it out. Now, change the position of this jumper J5 from BC to AB. Now, replace the card and switch on the system. As the second step, let's connect the audio output of the laptop to the analog input port of the system. Use an audio cable with this type of 3.5 mm pin. The third step is to select the audio output of laptop as a recording source. From any one of the single line telephones of the system, enter the programming mode by dialing 1 hash 91 followed by the system engineer password. This tone confirms that we have accessed the programming mode. Now, dial 2501 and then 2. Here, 2 is for selecting laptop as a recording source. At this point, please make a note that you can use any other music source like a cell phone, a music player, etc. in place of the laptop. The fourth step is to record the voice message. For that, first keep the voice message or the music file you want to record handy on your laptop. Next, on the single line telephone, dial 2502 and then 02. 02 is the voice module number. On entering the command, system will give a brief dial tone. When that dial tone ends, Start recording the voice message. Once you have finished the recording, press any number key. This is how it is done. This is the confirmation tone. It means that the voice message is recorded properly. If you do not press any digit, system will automatically give confirmation tone on completion of 16 seconds. The final step is to verify the recorded voice message. For that, dial 2503 and then 02. Transferring the call to the operator. Thus, we can verify the voice message recorded in the voice module 02. There we are, done with all the steps. Now, exit the programming mode by dialing 00. Similarly, you can record other voice messages into the remaining modules. Thank you for watching this video. I am sure this will be useful to you. For any help, please feel free to contact Metrics Technical Support.